Hello guys and welcome back to Ricky Dupe 365 Today I will be telling you guys who I'll be voting for. Uh, you know, uh, us YouTubers, we, we touch a lot of people. You know, one way or another, you know, we get, you know, a couple thousands of views. Some of them make millions. Uh, something I want to point out is that the top, the top 10 YouTubers reach a billion people every week. Every single week they reach uh, or they hit collectively uh, a billion views. So, most of the YouTubers will not uh, come out and tell you who they're going to be voting for. And I respect that, you know. But uh, I need you guys to go, you know, whoever you follow who is an American who will be voting in these elections. Uh, I would like for you to go to their channel and question them why uh, and who you're going to be voting for. I, I think that you should know where they stand in, in this regard with politics. Because this is a year where, uh, where we cannot make any fuck ups. And I will throw it out right there to you guys, but I will not be voting for, for Donald Trump. Okay? Do you believe that you've done anything to create a tone where this kind of violence would be encouraged? I hope not. I truly hope not. Get that guy out of here. Get him out of here. In the good old days, this doesn't happen because they used to treat them very, very rough. And when they protested once, you know, they would not do it again so easily. I will be voting for Hillary Clinton. That's... If you want to stop the video right here and say bullshit, whatever, hey, go ahead, do your thing. But uh, if you stay here so far with me, give me five minutes and I will tell you why. In the good old days, they'd rip him out of that seat so fast. So the first thing that that I see is that Donald Trump is conning everybody out there. You know, he's, he's, he's conning everybody. Uh, he's not giving uh, us the... Uh, the true him. Okay. I'd like to punch him in the face, I'll tell you. One of the things that he sells all the time is he's a winner. He's a winner of business and this and that. Uh, uh, and then I've been looking into and then uh, kind of difficult to believe. Uh, the only thing that he's been successful at is uh, The Apprentice and we know how that ends up. Alright, yeah, get him out. Try not to hurt him. If you do, I'll defend you in court. Don't worry about it. He been saying that he cares about the working, the working men, you know, the, uh, the this, this this working class, um, and not the elites. And I think that's bullshit, big time. Uh, he don't produce nothing in America, you know. He got many, many, many uh, products that he sells with his name, and none of them are made in America. You know, he has uh, outsourced other places to make his products and, and, and that sucks i love the old days you know what they used to do to guys like that when they were in a place like this they'd be carried out on a stretcher folks uh i think i really think that the uh, supreme court needs a, a conservative uh judge uh, and i don't think that donald trump can even name one conservative judge that will support him so um uh, I don't mention a couple of groups and this guy doesn't support or have shown uh, the direct uh, unsupport of those groups and uh, Latinos, women, Muslims, disabled, soldiers with PTSD, POWs, and parents of dead veterans. Uh, I'm saying this, you know, it took me a minute because it's, it's very serious, Touch, touches me. Very personal. Knock the crap out of him, would you? Seriously. Okay? Just knock the hell. So much fun. I love it. I love it. We having a good time? I don't think that Trump is a person who can be trusted, you know? Uh, but I'm just one guy. I'm just one guy.